So this is just a, a brief look at the Pluto wireless trigger. So this is a wireless uh, trigger for cameras. So basically it connects through Bluetooth to your phone. Very similar to the Meops or the old Nero camera trigger, except it doesn't have a screen. So everything is done through your phone. Um, it's supplied with a camera trigger cord. In my case, I've got a Nikon. Uh, it's supplied with a flash trigger the actual Pluto trigger which is this device and to put it in perspective it's about the size of a old school iPhone charger and there's also a laser um, emitter this laser emitter is for brake beam work that kind of stuff so very handy to have all of the functions of the Pluto trigger except for manual triggering are run through the phone um, there are a range of sensors on board the device, which are laser, sound, light, lightning, infrared. There's a droplet accessory you can buy. There's an auxiliary input, so you can actually make your own sensors. And there's also fusion, which allows you to uh, combine a number of different triggers to fire your camera shutter when something happens. So this device, Again, it's quite small. Um, it has a camera and flash input. It has a USB or micro USB charger, um, an auxiliary um, input output. Um, on the front, it's got a number of sensors. This is light and laser. This is infrared sensor, and that's infrared emitter. So basically, these allow it to trigger when light gets above a certain amount or when the infrared detects motion, those kinds of things. So it's quite good for if you're trying to do wildlife photography or lightning photography or any of those things. As well as the being able to trigger your camera through the um, camera trigger cable, you can also trigger flash. So there's a PC flash sync cord, which will just go into your flash sync on your flash um, and that will allow you to trigger the flash when um, a beam is broken or whatever else happens um, the second part to that though is that you can actually do high speed photography with this um, and basically you would almost have it separate to the camera so you do a long exposure with the camera um, the Pluto connects to your flash and when one of the appropriate triggers goes off, so it may be sound for example when you burst a balloon, um, it would then uh, fire the flash which gets enough light to expose the image um, and then you would close the shutter. All in all it's a pretty handy device, um, it, it's very small, it's pretty versatile. I haven't yet gone all over all of the functions. Um, and I will do that a little bit later on, so keep an eye out on my videos. If I could give you two tips, it would be, as well as the stuff that's supplied in the pack, which is the hot shoe adapter, Pluto wireless trigger, laser, your flash sync, and your camera. I would also suggest getting a male to male I think this is a 2.5 stereo extension cable and a male to female 2.5 millimeter extension cable. Um, I'll explain this in another video, so keep tuned, but very handy things to have. Um, stay tuned for more videos and uh, let me know what you think in the comments. Thank you.